Hi, my name is Lucas. I'm the team lead of the automation team at the Systems Austria, and we are running an automation solution to pretty much automate our whole data center. And this solution is based on Camunda. Well, I think the biggest challenge was that there was just no structured process before we had our solution. That means things were going like they were. Excel sheets were being sent via email, things filled out the form here or there, but there was just no structured way of achieving certain things. And then when we started implementing our solution, we were really the first entity in the, in the, in the, in the company that achieved to show and to document a process from the beginning to the end. And then we built up on that. That means starting with us, you had a process where you could say, okay, for a creation of a virtual machine. I need the following steps in the following order and those people are relevant within the process. And just by achieving that, we created a lot of value. And what we even achieved was we shrink down the time, for example, for the deployment of a virtual machine from up to four weeks to, well, two or one week uh, at the first stage because that was the first time we've implemented the structured process which still was executed manually but then after we brought in more and more automation until the whole process was pretty much fully automated we've managed to cut the time down to around 20 minutes from ordering a new virtual machine until a finished virtual machine that can be delivered to the customer so the throughput to achieve something or to create value is just uh, reduced immensely so it takes instead of four weeks just 20 minutes right now that also brings in cost because if things go faster they usually cost less and the third thing is quality because previously all the documentation was pretty much done per hand manually things were entered in different systems by a person who could make errors right and by implementing our solution, we pretty much had all the documentation like uh, done in an automated fashion. So there was no room for error left and therefore we also could increase the quality tremendously. It makes life way easier for them because previously they at first, they needed to know how the process works. That means they needed to find some per person who already was using the process so they could explain them how the process is initiated, how it started. And then usually it was their responsibility to download some random Excel from a random share, fill it out with data that was probably outdated, and then they needed to send it to some random email address distribution list, right? So, and then they needed to hope that the process was finished in a certain time frame. And by implementing our solution, we really delivered them all the rubber items from a catalog that they can choose from. So they just access our website and they get a catalog, they click on the item that they want, they fill out a form that is pretty much like self-explanatory and then they start a process. And they even can like see in a transparent fashion where the process is like standing right now, what the next steps are, what steps already were executed, and so on and so forth. So most of our processes deal with some things that are going on in our data center. That means they are technical by nature. Okay? So that means our like, business stakeholders, stakeholders from outside our team, they are already technical teams that deal with certain aspects of operating a data center. So where we could help, or where we could see the biggest benefits is that we um, that we make the um, collaboration between those technical teams easier because of um, instead of relying on email communication between those teams, they really had a structured process in the backend where they were assigned tasks when they were needed. So they receive a user task when it's their turn to do something. And that's probably the biggest benefit of making sure that the collaboration works better. Well, we are proud and motivated because it, we can really say that it was our team that um, changed the way our company is working. So, because previously things were done in a completely different way and now people can use the platform and the automation solution that we built that, to achieve the things that they want and to generate value in the end. People in such a large corporation, they know that things can be slow and that there are a lot of legacy systems and there is a lot of outdated software that they have to use because it's there and it's in implemented in, in a way so that they do not get around with that. However, after we've implemented our solution, it was really the first time that they see something that is modern, that is working and where they can benefit from. The most beneficial part of performing a migration from Camunda 7 to Camunda 8 is really just to use the newest available technology that is there. Because 
by using, as I said, cutting ed edge technology, we as an IT provider can really guarantee that we know what we are doing and that we can also sell things that are modern and not outdated. And I think just being a role model for that, making sure that we as a company also use cutting ed edge technology is one part um, or one essential, one essential thing, or yeah, it's essential for convincing our customers that we know what we are doing. What we really like about Camunda is the modernization and the openness. So what you can do with Camunda is you have your workflow, but it's like your part on how you want to have it implemented. That means you as a user of the workflow engine can decide how your processes should be executed. Camunda helps you to a certain degree because Camunda makes sure to tell you which tasks comes, comes after what other tasks and who is now responsible for doing what. But you as a developer or you as an yeah, application developer can decide on how you want to have that implemented. And, that's, and this is an openness that we really pursued and what we really like about the platform.